Hi. I'm not ready yet, but I wanted to go. Because I don't have a lot of time today. I've got about 40 minutes from now. A little longer. Oh god, I love this game. You have no idea how much I love this game. <laughs> hey, Zero. I see you in there. Uh, oh, I guess that's technically boobies. But it's part of the game, so whatever. Let's put the chat over here. This is Deadly Premonition. She's been cut apart. It's disgusting. Look at those red leaves. Look at that tree. It's fucked up. So this is this this game is about being a detective. Look at those twins. This shit is chilling. Um let's see. So this is Deadly Premonition. Those twins just found a body in the woods. And that's their grandfather, I think. They know who she is. Because it's a small town in the Pacific Northwest. If you haven't seen Twin Peaks and Zero, I know you haven't seen Twin Peaks. Um, the, a lot of this is just going to be weird references. I mean, not a lot of it, but... See, that's very weird. What the fuck, man? This game is like basically what the fuck level all the time. I promise that's the last of the nudity, though. I'm sorry, I forgot about that. Um, <clears throat> this is Deadly Premonition. It has an amazing soundtrack. Which I think is a little quiet. There we go. Well, let's see if it's... Aim setting. Alright. Sound. Okay, that's as high as it goes. Yes, I'd love to cancel my changes. And sorry this guy started a little late. I was having problems with this uh, add-on setup. Unlocks ability to buy one possible house. What the hell? Expert car able to drift. What is this weird shit? Alright, whatever. Okay, um... Deadly Premonition is amazing, and we're just gonna get to it right now. I was having some problems with this thing freezing. So Deadly Premonition would like to tell you that it's a horror game. It is not a horror game. It is a game about somebody getting murdered and being a weird detective. It is basically Twin Peaks the game. Um, this is... It's been a while since I've played this, so I don't actually remember a lot of it. Mm. I want to hear another story. Ah, uh, yes. Of course. You've been waiting a long time for this, so... How about a special one? This story is very strange and very nasty. Yeah. But somewhat nostalgic. Do you think you can be a good girl and listen all the way to the end? That guy's creepy. Is it a scary story? It might be. Apparently has no face. But... It's also a very uh, important story. I know who that guy is. If you don't want to hear it... My gif? I oh, can gif. tell you a different story. No, I want to hear it. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna buy me that I'm mouse, Zero? Really that is a good... No, that's a good TV mouse. I actually might buy that. Leave the sound down, like always. Leave the sound down, like always. I missed that. What's leaving? All right. Well, zero, now, that's that's good. I think I'll get that. This is important. At times, we must purge things from this world because they should not exist. Should not exist. Even if it means losing someone that you love. Oh. This is heartbreaking knowing knowing this already. All right. Um I'm going to let this game kind of Talk. I'm not going to talk over it like I usually do because I'm an asshole. You know I'm an asshole, right? <laughs> this game is weird. That's a good looking mouse, man. I've heard of that uh, brand before, I think, too. It's got like a million buttons. Holy shit. That's nice. 
All right, let's see if this works. Yes, it works! Yay! Hi. That's my uh, icon on on G Chat, by the way. Let's see. Ah, yes. Here we go. The floor is covered with red leaves, like a carpet laid for VIPs. Observe what? All right. Let's. These two are talking in Simlish. Let's get down. Talk. Could you wait just a little longer? This won't take long. This game is creepy as fuck. <laughs> um. All right, let's look at these. What's over here? When A Y is displayed on screen, act with A. Observe with Y. Just figured that out. I already knew that. Thank you. A doll shaped like a fat man has a plate on it which reads Washington State. Oh, look, there's a bunch of little dolls shaped like him, right? <laughs> there's a lot of foreshadowing in this game if you know uh, if you know what you're looking for. A strange clock is ticking away, though the room itself makes you feel as if time has stopped. This game is weird as hell, Zero. You have no idea, and it is absolutely one of my favorite games. A white screen. Sorry to keep you waiting. It will start soon. It will start soon. It's about time to get started. He kind of sounds like Tails from Sonic, but super creepy. Mm. I don't need skill juice for this game. Because it's... it's There's... <coughs> excuse me. There are parts of this game that are really Zach. bad. Zack, can you hear me? It's me, York. Hi, York. How you doing? If you can hear my voice, could you respond? <laughs> I'm Zack. Ah, good. I thought you went to sleep. No, I never sleep. Zack, don't be surprised. The crime took place out in the country this time. Let's take it slow. Let's take it slow. Okay, Zach? Okay. Alright, sure. York. Francis York Morgan. So, the combat in this game is horrible. Typically, it's a good selection. Sure, that's one way of looking at it. Uh, it's totally wrong. Francis York Morgan, FBI Special Agent. Oh, that makes me want to say you're so bad. Um, Listen, they both need each other. It's called interdependency, and they both know it. It's really bad, like, really just Yeah, I know. Stupid. He does terrible things to Tom. Nasty, even sadistic things. But that's fine, as long as that's what Tom wants. Think of it. It's actions. He's always asking for it. Really? It's his partner's job to fulfill that need, and Jerry knows that. We're talking about Tom and Jerry. <laughs> Well, in the Tom and Jerry show, they live with each other. Hello? Hello? Nope. Bad news, Um, uh, The combat is really bad and kind of repetitive. I can't believe the Bureau still can't get me a satellite. <laughs> is it that loud? Alright, hold on. These puppies are making me go to another town in the Boondocks again. These puppies. Well. That's a little better, I think, now. I'm being a waste of time. At the very least, they get me cramped city for a while. Yeah. Right, Zach? Right. The perpetrator from the last case really was something. We'll get to the game bits. razors laced in your nails. That's how we got those scars. Just crazy. At least I now have a scar to show off. Police. See this? I got this when I arrested the Catwoman wannabe. <laughs> crazy. Don't you agree, Zach? I don't think women are crazy. Because you're talking to yourself, uh, York. No smoking. <laughs> uh, he's talking to himself, obviously. And crash. That's Donald Duck. I'm not doing anything.
thing yet still. This is just the game. <laughs> and he's dead. That's it. That's the end of the game. There's no more. And your car is fucked up. So, uh, yes, the combat in this game... <laughs> yeah, I know, man, like... I can't do a very good job here. Hold on, hold on. Let's make this a little better. Edit scene. We're gonna do some things here. Edit, edit, edit. Nah, he's not dead. I'm being a dick. Shrink this. You're, now your lighter finally works. Oh, oh York. <laughs> this bent ass cigarette. I'm gonna upgrade my bandwidth soon so I can do higher resolution streams. I just haven't gotten around to it. Huh. Zach, there goes the civilized world. Yeah, welcome to hell. Mission knife. Trying to rearrange it so that the, my low resolution. You wanna save? Yes, I'd love to save. He just walks away, yeah. You're sort of a badass. Sort of. He has a flashlight. Nowhere on his person. It just emanates from his very body. See? Um, so, let's see. Take item. This game really branded itself as a uh, survival horror game. And it's really, really super not. Like, it is absolutely a detective game. It is nothing. The survival horror bits are the parts that stand out as being very kind of crap. Um, what? What is this? The toolbox. Oh, yeah. That's another thing about this game. There's a toolbox here that is basically a universal chest. You can put stuff in and take stuff out anywhere. So, um... Change weapon. Equip weapon and draw it with left bumper. Draw weapon and aim with R. Ah, okay. I remember how to play this now. Well? Are you gonna shoot? Oh, oh, that's right. Oh, this is not confusing at all. <laughs> I've got a lovely bunch of coconuts. All of them are sitting in a row. Uh, let's see. Ooh. Hear the zombies? There are zombies. I'm spoiling this. I don't care. He's profiling. So he's an FBI profiler. FYI. And a lot of the, the weird horror parts are like this. Flash, flash, flash. He has no idea what the fuck's going on yet. Looks like we're being welcomed. Zach, I'll let you handle the meet and greet. I have a quality thing? What? What are you talking about? Quality is only for Twitch members? What are you talking about? I don't have a quality thing. I I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I really legit don't. All right, all right, York. You better pick up the pace, cause you're slow as fuck. Let's see. Look at that sky. Beautiful. Ooh, so creepy. Let's see. Um, yeah, this game is not scary at all. Whoa. Well, that's a little scary. I remember when I first played it, I was a little bit like, hmm, I don't know about this. Here we go. Oh, there's a dead dog. Huh? Huh? Oh. Oh, you can choose quality. I see what you're talking about. I have no idea. I don't I don't change these things. Observe. Hmm, so much my hope for my hopes for a peaceful picnic. Do me a favor and stay sharp, Zach. So, one of the uh the brilliant things about this game is that York is York, obviously. Zach is his second personality. He talks to himself, and he has a second personality. But it's also the player. Whenever he talks about somebody like, like shooting his gun and things like that, he uh, 
he'll compliment Zach on how good of a shooter he is. So he's talking to you as the player, which is just a bizarre way of doing things. So, I don't know, man. Uh, it's it's brilliant. I, 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 will, I will tell you more why I think it's brilliant a little bit later, but we'll, let's get through the story part first. Um, huh, what's here? Oh, a can of pickles. I will take those pickles. The pickle. <laughs> That's what it said on the can. Where'd that, uh, where'd that lady go? She ain't here. Oh, well. That's weird, man. I don't know. Maybe it's, uh, unlocked for everybody. Maybe I'm just special. I'm glad it looks better to you. <laughs> well, I turned on the gate, so it's fine now. Beep. Face, that face. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. I am going to be big and famous. You don't even know. Oh, yeah. There we go. That. That's uh, Kama Sutra number 15. Uh, I got Mysterious Shadow. No, I didn't. I didn't. What? Oh, it's evidence. That's right. You have to collect the three pieces of evidence before you can leave the horror sideshow. Okay. That The weapon explanations are actually wrong. Bye, Shadow. There, I just got ten bucks for that. That's this is the kind of game this is. Oh, God. I do hate these shadows. They're just everywhere. And there's some of the, they do some of the nastiest things I've seen in a game. Um, it You know, Zero, it's never clear. It's never clear throughout the entire game. You collect these pieces of evidence. Um, whoa, shit. I, don't, I can't figure out how to run, by the way. You collect these pieces of evidence, and then nobody else seems to know what's going on as far as, like, they don't experience these these shadows. But then it becomes a very important part of the story that these things exist, or at least that one of them exists, one very important one. Um, it's it's strange. So it's really never fully explained, and, and I guess I'm okay with that. Um... He definitely takes it in stride, though. He's just like, huh, weird, creepy shadow. Uh, got the, yeah, yeah, okay, that's fine. Why did I do this? All right. I've been through a lot of crazy situations, but that one, that one takes the cake. It's the first time I've been attacked so directly. Zach, can you give me a logical explanation about what that was? Sorry, Zach, I can't. Never mind, don't answer. Life is fun because of the mysteries. Right, Zach? Yeah, you're right, York. Hey, Zoom! What do you mean, oh no, this game? This game's amazing! I fucking love this game. I know it's bad, but I love it. Lollipop! And I'm really excited to be playing it again. Oh, yeah, you can save at telephones. Just like Earthbound. Yeah, I'd love to save. He's calling the FBI. Being like, so... I killed some shadow people, and I I crashed my car because of a guy in a red raincoat with an axe. You know, the huge. They're like, York, you don't even work for us anymore. What are you doing? Oh, did you zoom? That's awesome. I love this game, and, and you, uh, you're wrong, but that's fine. <laughs> Oh, crap. Just shot her in the butt. Damn it, die. Oh, you're not dead yet? Jeebus. Oh. Oh, she is dead. Jesus. Takes, <laughs> takes forever. Um, no, I won't argue with you that parts of this game are just horrendously bad. Like, really quite bad. Um, but, uh, yeah, no, I'd like to hear it. I'm down with that. I'm always down for differing opinions. Differing but wrong opinions. 
Uh, right, you can push boxes. That's right. Yeah, Zero says that's not normal. Whoa! That guy's got a golf club. Now we're talking business here. Gonna shoot it out of his hand and then shoot him in the head. Whew! Alright, that was really not hard. Oh, he had a steel pipe, my bad. He's not gonna play golf with that. You could, but he's not going to. And then you get these little badges for. I don't know why. For yeah, That's uh, 30 bucks. It's just sitting there. EA, 8,000. All right. Um, can I run? I swear to God, I can run in this game. Observe an old sign. I can make out, well, Greenvale, basically. Looks like we're headed down this road, Zach. <laughs> Nice. Oh, I needed something to listen to on the on the ride to work anyway. Oh, okay. So it's kind of correct. If you hold right trigger, it locks onto the enemy. Then you can aim for their head. There we go. So the PC version of this game is notorious for being kind of shit. So I expect crashes and things like that, and I apologize in advance for all the technical issues I'm gonna have. So uh, yeah, I just wanna. Throw that out there. Um, but there's all sorts of, <laughs> like, uh, oh, come on. Yeah, there you go. You can't really hear it, probably, but uh, York is actively complimenting himself on, on such good shooting, which he's really complimenting Zach. <laughs> Yeah, this game is sort of in an unacceptable state, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> um, I think that this patch makes it better. Like, it's on version 2 now, which, I mean, that's pretty significant. I was kind of waiting for something like that to officially start playing it. I've actually bought this game three times now, and I've still yet to spend more than $30 total. I spent $20 because it was $20 new on the 360. I spent, like, 10 bucks on a bundle and got it in there. And I spent 5 bucks on it today because it was the good old games version, so DRM free and everything. And I always appreciate that. So yeah, I would say... Ooh, first aid kit. Yes! Yeah, I love that. Nice. Good. Nice. Good shot. It's beautiful. He's telling you you're a good shot. Because that's what York is, uh, split... He's That's his personality split. He's got... His main personality, Francis York Morgan, is the talking one and the, the thinking one. And Zack is the one that takes over when the action comes down, you know? Uh, that's you. And, uh, oops. That's, I love that split. That dichotomy is so bizarre. I've never seen anything in a game, ever. Oh, God, somebody fucked this up, didn't they? And he does that thing where he taps on his chest when he thinks. The generator looks really bad, Zack. I think the killer really had a grudge against it. Oh. Great hair! Sweet smile! <laughs> Good impact! Yep. I'm great. Alright. We got... I don't need to see this. We only have two pieces of evidence. Huh? Zack, let's try to find a way to fix this mess. I got fuse box, I got fuse box, I don't know why I got the fuse box, I can't remember how to solve this, but everything is nice and blue and shiny, so you don't have to worry about it. Wait, I keep doing that, I keep going to the toolbox thing, there's going to be something in there. There's not. Let's see. Doot, 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 a doot, doot, doot. Um, one, oh god, is that a power wire? Alright, I'm fine. Okay, so that's locked. I can't go in there. I swear to God, I could run, though. Oh, there we go. Come on. Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> um, perfect. So, I was playing... You're still... You're stuck on the quality thing, Zero. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Open it. Nope. It's stuck. Yeah, the run button is left trigger, which I swear to God didn't work before, but... Huh. Well, maybe... Maybe that other door is open. 
Let's observe. Locked with a padlock. I should be able to break this if I can hit it hard enough. Ah, yes, I can hit it hard enough. Here's a weird thing about this game. Your gun, your your pistol has unlimited ammo, uh, but melee weapons break. So I tend to use the uh, the pistol for everything because I have unlimited ammo. The melee weapons are actually really good. Like, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Uh, can, the the melee weapons actually do a lot of damage, so it's good to keep them around. But it is funny how much I shoot locks and boxes and things like that. Come on, get over there. Thank you. There we go. Just shove in the fuse box. Chunk. Just appears. Chunk. <laughs> Just decisively. power in the area should be much more stable now. Let's hurry ahead, Zack. So, I have enough viewers. That would be, uh, what, two? <laughs> you know you're, you're, you've hit it big time and you've got two viewers. Um, I don't know, man. Zero. It's just, just, just let it go. Just, just take a deep breath. Breathe in the air and breathe out the worries about quality. In and out. <laughs> Think about... Uh, imagine all the people. That's what you should do. There we go. Um, I don't know any of the more of the lyrics to that song, sorry. <laughs> there we go. I mean, I assume it's a bug as well. Oh, God. These shadows are pretty fucking creepy as far as I'm concerned. The way that they move, like, backwards like that and bend all fucked up. You should see them when they actually hit me. And they will. Yeah. I'm glad it looks better. I think it... I don't know, man. I need to get, uh... I need to upgrade my bandwidth so I can just stream at full resolution. I'm, I'm running on... I'm running on 3 megabits per second right now. I want you to know that this is a fucking miracle that I can do anything... Um, there we go. Fuck off. Fuck off, lady. Oh, God, and they do that thing where they zap closer to you. I hate it. Nice shot. Thank you, York. There we go. Um, perfect. I'm great. <laughs> Headshot reward. Heck yes. This place is nasty. And that, I love that they, some of them go forwards and some go backwards, so their heads are in different places every time. As much as, like, this game is shit, like, the, the, the shooting is just boring as crap, um, they tried, they really tried. I wish they would just honestly have cut it out, just made a straight-up adventure game with creepy, weird, two-personality York Morgan. Oh, fuck. Thank you. Oh, what is that? Oh, first aid kit? Heck yes! Beautiful tapper, well pressed suit. <laughs> Zoom, you have a good sense of humor. <laughs> fuck off, fuck off. God damn. These will eventually, this black hole shit where the enemies are coming from will eventually go away if you kill enough of them, I want to say. Which, again, poorly thought out. Oh fuck, oh god, she hit me with a shovel. Ow. Bam! 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 Yeah, there you go. Well, I guess it's not going away. We're just gonna let it ride. I'm just gonna just let that go. Just relax about it. Imagine all star people. You know what? Fuck you. I don't even need your bullshit. Thank you. Did that guy follow me? Yeah, he did. Uh, irritating. Fuck off! No! Fuck him! Shoot him in the head! There we go. And he's dead. Okay. Do 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 do. Whoa! Oh right. 
Shit! Oh, the quick time event. I fucked it up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. What? I did it! Ah, oh, shit. I, ah, oh, fuck. I forgot the quick time events. So the raincoat killer is the best part of the gamey parts. Um, please tell me you, you gave me some... Oh, are you fucking kidding me? I'm fine. You know what? I don't even care. I don't need you bullshit heads. You shitheads. I'll just run past you all. You are pointless shadows. <laughs> See? I <laughs> can't keep up with me. York's heart rate is going way up, but, you know. Here we go. We're just back already. Fuck it. I think. Okay. Hua! Yeah, raincoat killer. Fuck you. I am dressed as the raincoat killer in Minecraft, by the way. <laughs> I don't need you bullshit heads. Yep. I have a way with words, just like I have a way with horses. I'm the horse whisperer. Open. Oh, good. I thought they might be creepy leaves instead of just normal leaves. Where's that pink light coming from? Oh, well, there's the creepy leaves. Huh? Huh? This is when he's talking to Zack. Or thinking about Zack, I guess. I don't know. Here we go. We'll do the profiling. Now you can see all the evidence compiles into this weird little cutscene that's going on in his brain. And I don't know how he's gathered all of this information so far, but a lot of those are characters that have come up. So a lot of foreshadowing in this game. Mmm, lollipop. Lollipop, lollipop, oh lolly, lolly, lolly. I wish my webcam wasn't so delayed from my speech. I need to figure out how to fix There's that. There's definitely something in this town. Something in the water. Do you feel it, Zach? My coffee warned me about it. His coffee warned Yesterday him. Yesterday morning, the milk I poured in my coffee made a sign. Did it? It said, tomorrow you'll arrive in a place that will change your fate. Extra for profiling. What the fuck does that mean? Well, we're saving. Great. I'd love to save. Uh, let's see. Did I save? Alright. So, we're just gonna walk this, I guess. <laughs> Come on, York. Pick up the pace. So now we are in the town. <laughs> what are you guys doing in there? <laughs> oh my god. Um, <laughs> this is the town of Greenvale. Welcome to Greenvale. Nature Preserve. Lake County Forest Preserves. God, his shoes must be soggy as fuck. How does he keep his suit so nicely pressed? Look at him. Look at that. He looks so nice after having been dragged through the mud. Got he bet car crash. Walking through the mud, the rain, at night, while zombies attack him. And he's like, freshly pressed. <laughs> like a crisp spring morning. <laughs> I miss the medal. I don't care about the medals. <laughs> There's very little I care about except basically watching this game happen. Now you were very late. <laughs> Emily Wyatt. So long. <laughs> Where the fuck is your car? FBI Special Agent, Francis York Morgan. Please, just call me York. That's what everyone calls me. Agent York? Good, that's good. Good, good. Well done. You Are said you my sheriff? name. Uh, no, I'm Deputy Sheriff Emily Wyatt. George, he's the sheriff. He went looking for you, actually. He should be back soon. See, you know... I see. York's progressive. He thought she was the sheriff immediately. Me, Good job. Walk all the way here? She walk all the fucking way. My car broke down, that's all. See, he immediately lies. He's weird. Awkward stairs. She's easy on the eyes. 
definitely worth a trip to the primitive world. And not but progressive don't anymore. Mention anything about what happened back there. She'll think you're a psycho. <laughs> huh. Don't want that, do we, Zach? Welcome. <laughs> she like right in front of her. I'm the sheriff. George Woodman. Call me George. <laughs> Good strong name. Sweet haircut. <laughs> Look at that haircut. FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. Please just call me York. That's what everyone calls me. <laughs> Could you tell me why the FBI is so interested in a small town homicide? Let's just say it's a personal interest in killers of young women. I'm always looking for new sample cases to help me with my. You hate King George? I love King Both George. Superiors have cleared this with each other. You can remain in command. You don't have a problem with this, do you? No. No problem. Just want to set things straight. Our small town has its share of problems. I'm the one fixing them one by one and maintaining. <laughs> How dramatically can you light a cigarette? <laughs> Yeah, King George is a, is a douche. Of course. He's a huge douche. Did you finish this game, Zoom? I had a little accident with my car. A little. Could you send someone to take care of it? Oh, and my clothes and luggage are still inside. All right. Don't worry. I'll get my assistant Thomas to take care of it. Good old Thomas. Love Thomas. Do you need anything else? Thanks. <laughs> Well then, I think I'll rest up first at the hotel. Then I'll join you on your investigation. You'll be finishing you it with me, it. Zoom. But, uh, we really don't need your help. Unlike some of your hey, elite. city police officers. I have to leave in four minutes. <laughs> I hope you'll come to appreciate agent. Oh man. And we'll handle the investigation. You just think of this as a vacation. Take it easy. Enjoy the nature here. That perfectly blue river that doesn't move or have any texture. To appreciate the wildlife here. If you know what I mean. <laughs> I don't know what I mean. Zach, let's reassess the situation. There are no cavemen here. We're as far forward as the Middle Ages. And <laughs> we've just met the king. King George. Oh, Assassin's Creed with no ships. I've never played any Assassin's Creed games. Actually, I played the first one for a while and I didn't like it. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Total clear time. Let's see. Let's see if I get a good grade. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Yay. I cleared. Payment rewarded. 200 bucks. Basic wage, unpaid salary. This game is so weird. It's like, here's your salary. What? <laughs> Just everything about this game is bizarre. Yeah, I've heard that the fr that, that the other ones are better. I just never got into it. I don't need to see it previously during the investigation. I'll, I'll skip that. Mercifully, I will skip that. See, these are new. These are new. Been using that one for a long time. Why didn't you get it repaired? This TV is important to you, right? It's got some memories attached to it, sure. I used to watch movies on this thing with your grandma all the time. Grandma liked movies? Of course she did. She liked a lot of Everyone stuff. Everyone loves movies. Right? She really liked it when I we watched. Well, well, anyway, I can't tell you about I've never that. Never been to a movie theater, though. Never been to a movie theater. Who are you? You're weird. Episode one, first day of investigation. Angel Isaac. Oh, yeah, you get trading cards. Good old. Let's see. I need to save because I need to leave. <laughs> I need to catch a bus. A bus to work town. Welcome to York's dreams.
Yeah, that was a joke, Sarah. <laughs> oh, God. She really liked... <laughs> she really liked the gangbang stuff. If you know what I mean. I mean, I guess that's what I mean. Lord of the G-Strings. Her favorite movie was Sex Toy Story 2. Oh, fuck. Now he's having bad dreams. Don't breathe. Hold your breath. Oh, I forgot about that. They can't see you if you hold your breath. Hurry. Like this. Cover your mouth. Uh, right. Thank you, weird little child, for teaching me this. The real challenge is to try and hold your breath with York. Dude, back off. You smell like old oh, cheese. You look you look worse than that though. You look worse. You actually look worse than you smell somehow. Where are your teeth? Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll hold my breath every time York has to. There we go. Just, o just open the door. See, you're fine now. Can I let go? Yes, I can. I know who it is. The zombie was, yeah, I was doing a little bit of like break dancing. <laughs> Hey, little kid. Ooh, so bright. So bright. A can of pickles will satisfy a small amount of your hunger. I'm trying to peer through the blinds here. Okay. Come on. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thank you, Zoom. <laughs> I've already died once at this game, though, so... <sighs> I need to go, man. Come on, wake up. Wake up. Up you go. There you go. Oh, that blanket is made of lumps. That blanket was gross. Looks like a meat blanket. Come on, come on, come on. Zach, the symbolism in my dreams continues to intensify. I need that morning cigarette. A forest of red trees. A carpet with red leaves. A strange doll. Twin angels. But that child is what bothers me the most. I swear I've seen him before. I just can't remember. I did zoom. I know I can save in the hotel, though. Well, it'll probably come back to me eventually. Yes, yes. For now, we need coffee. We need coffee. Cheers. Can you, can you even see that? There we go. Cheers. Here we Let's go. Head to the cafeteria, Zach. No. I hope We're going to have some real coffee. I really need some coffee. You really? Then I can't. You can head to the sheriff's office. Shut up. There's a proper procedure for everything. There's a proper Zach. procedure for everything, Zach. Ah, all right, cool. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Save. My soothing voice. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. I. Uh, this is my phone. Well, actually, my phone voice is much more irritating. Back when I used to work customer service. Definitely had that going on. The like, hi, how can I help you? And some fucking, what are you? Some cheesy. Di uh, anyway, um, all right. I'll be back tomorrow. I'll probably switch back and forth between this and amnesia until I finish amnesia. Uh, cool. Sorry, elite. I know I always go when you when you come in. It's not you. I promise. <laughs> it's my bus. Uh, all right. Thanks for watching. I'll catch y'all tomorrow. Same time ish. How do I quit? Title. There we go. Okay. Bye.